Hello everybody and welcome to Dragon Tech Tales. Sorry for the long hiatus, but today we're going to be looking at an awesome mouse that is perfect for anybody that wants a honeycomb mouse or a lightweight mouse for FPS gaming. The mouse is going to be the Fantech Hive UX2. This is a new product by Fantech and it's something that I'm really excited to show to all of you guys. Additionally, we're going to be taking a quick look at the Fantech Firefly RGB gaming mouse pad. Without further ado, Let's go. Simply put, the Hive UX2 features a pretty unique design with honeycomb cutouts allowing for reduced weight and RGB elements to shine through. The weight of the Hive UX2 is only 74 grams, which is the industry standard golden weight, quote unquote, for FPS games. It is worth mentioning that the Hive UX2's mouse skate is fully compatible with the Logitech G Pros as well as the Tiger Arcs and Hyperglides, which makes for easy replacement when the time comes. The UX2 sensor is a Pixart 3360, which is the same base sensor as the G Wolf Skull, and it is one of the best sensors on the market today, according to Sensor FYI. It is also worth mentioning that the UX2 does support an ambidextrous design meaning that it is good for both left-handed and right-handed users. However, the design is not fully supported as two of the macro buttons are only available on the left side, which means they would be covered by a left-handed user's palm. However though, the build quality of the UX2 is pretty great. Even though it is lightweight and is completely made out of plastic, it feels durable. There aren't any wobbling or rattling noises or any other mild annoyances that could impede a gamer's performance. It does even include a paracord cable, which performs well without a mouse bungee. Aside from the UX2's stunning looks, it also features a customizable liftoff distance to suit a gamer's every need. The weight of 74 grams and the featureful compatibility of this mouse make it a must purchase for all gamers. We felt that the lightweight of the mouse, as well as the honeycomb design, has helped our palms to not sweat as much while gaming, and we've even encountered a little bit less wrist strain because of this too. Thank you for watching this week's episode of Dragon Tech Tales. Be sure to like and subscribe and leave a comment. Now, if you didn't like the video, you know what to do. Have a good one everybody. Lolly, lolly, lolly.